Experiment number 14. Specific heat of a solid. Objective. The activity aims to determine the specific heat of a solid. Materials. One set. Aluminum calorimeter. One piece. Inner vessel of the double boiler. One set. Steam generator. One unit. Top loading balance. One set. Temperature sensor with probe. One unit. Laptop. 70 gram. Solid lead shots. Procedure. Data Studio 1. Connect the temperature sensor to the laptop 2. Launch Data Studio Display Digits and increase precision to two decimal places Steam Generator 1. Fill the steam generator half to three quarters full with water Plug the steam generator into a three receptacle outlet and start harding the water 2. Weigh about 70 grams of the solid whose specific heat will be determined 3. Place the lead shots inside the inner vessel of the double boiler. 4. Place the inner vessel with the lead shot in the steam generator to heat the lead shots. Calorimeter and water. Note, while heating the lead shots perform the steps below. 1. Wave the inner cup and stirrer of the calorimeter. 2. Fill the inner cup about one-fourth full with water. 3. Place the probe of the temperature sensor into the cup with water. Record this temperature reading of the water and the aluminum cup. Note, compare reading against room temperature. 4. Weigh the inner cup with water. 5. Determine the mass of water. Mixture. 1. When the temperature of the lead shots is constant or the highest reading is attained. Open the calorimeter cup and quickly transfer the solid from the inner vessel of the double boiler to the calorimeter cup. 2. Cover the calorimeter cup immediately and stir. Place the probe of the temperature sensor to measure the temperature of the mixture. Note: Avoid splashing of water and do not allow the solid to come in contact with the thermometer. 3. Observe and record the highest temperature of the mixture. Record this as the final temperature of the lead shot, water, and aluminum cup. Observations The ratio of heat added to the mass and change in temperature is able to determine the specific heat of solid. The heat loss of the hot lead shots was gained by the aluminum cup and stirrer with water. The mixture composed of hot lead shots with water in the calorimeter. Their final temperature are all equal. The water in the calorimetric cup must be stirred in order to uniformly distribute the heat in the system. The method of heat transfer during the entire experiment was convection. Three quarters of water were put in the steam generator and heated then the lead shots after the water turned into steam. Conclusion Using the method of mixtures is a simple and effective way for calculating the specific heat of a solid which means that it is a method of determining the heat of fusion of a substance whose specific heat is known in which an amount of solid is combined with a liquid in calorimeter. The experiment helps to clearly understand the concept of specific heat and explains that the amount of heat required by a solid to change its temperature by a certain amount is called specific heat. It is observable when the hot lead is transferred from the container, it slowly distributed the heat in the system. The percentage error was obtained depending on the environment's temperature which means if the environment's temperature is cold, the heat from the solid when transferring from one container to another, the loss of heat is fast.